Hello everyone, in this video we are going to learn how to create a strategy using the plus and minus DI indicators which are a part of the ADX indicator. Once you are on the streak homepage, you'll have to click on the second button at the bottom navigation bar and then we'll click on the create button. I'll give it a name. I'd like to call it DI strategy. Then we'll click on the create button. First of all, we'll have to choose our position. Then I'll click here to switch to the advanced mode. We'll click on the add button so that we can add stocks. Once we've added the stocks, now we are ready to create the entry and exit conditions. First of all, we'll create the entry condition by clicking here. So we'll click here on this region where it's saying what you would like to add. We want to start with the plus DI indicator. So we'll type plus and we'll select the plus DI indicator. Click on done. We'll click on the add button so that we can add the comparator. We'll search for crosses above. We'll click on the add button again. And this time we'll search for the minus DI indicator. We'll select it and click on the done button. So we want to enter when the plus DI indicator crosses above the minus DI indicator. We'll click on the done button. Now we can create the exit conditions by clicking here. So I want to exit if 1% stop loss is hit or 2% target is hit. And then we'll click on the done button again. We can click on this pencil icon over here to modify certain parameters. So I'd like to change the quantity. I would like to change the candle interval. And then we'll click on the done button again. Now we are ready to click on the run backtest button. As you can see, the backtest has started running and we've also got the results over here. To do in-depth analysis, you simply have to click on the stock. Here you will find the detailed backtest report of the stock and many more options like the brokerage button. And you can also see the transaction details by clicking here. Along with date and time, each and every transaction has been displayed over here. Once you've done your analysis, you can select the stocks that you would want to trade and you may click on the deploy button. Here you have two options. You can either go for paper trading or live trading. You can change the quantity by clicking here. You can select strategy cycles, holding types, strategy live for, variety, etc. And then click here and click on live trade. Now the strategy is live in the market.